look, there is a bit of unnecessary uncertainty around this motion, but let's look at it constructively. There is a review ongoing, and there are plenty of issues in relation to the challenges. Uh, certainly one of the issues around the rural cha challenges where we have private operators um, under considerable economic and financial pr pressure as a result of um, minimum subventions. And I think we have to ensure that the rural uh, challenges and the rural uh, opportunities for bringing people into the more urban areas that, that they are addressed. Secondly, disability access, Minister, from the letter Kenny to Derry, or sorry, from Little Kenny to Dublin on Bus Air, and we still don't have disability access, and I think that's something that we have to uh, ensure happens sooner ra rather than later. But, Minister, can I ask you for your intervention and your um, uh, assistance in relation to an issue in in relation to the Bunkrana Derry route, uh, a private operator has taken over the Loch Swally route. Um, and as you're aware, because of the review, uh, existing uh, contracts or existing operators doesn't automatically mean that the new operator gets uh, subvention or the travel passes be, be, be recognised. So we have a situation now whereby elderly people uh, between D uh, Derry and, and Bunkrana, people with disabilities, people with invalidity passes, um, do, do, are not being recognised. So, Minister, what, in, in maybe your last few hours in office, uh, in this particular office, maybe you'll be heading for higher elevated positions within the next 48 hours or less. Uh, but I would ask for your intervention, and I'm glad to see you have an official with you as well. I would ask for the Minister for Social Protection, because it is her brief, uh, to examine critically the number of people on invalidity passes on the Derry to Bunkrana route, because anecdotally I've got quite a large number uh, of, of people on invalidity passes and disability passes on the Derry to Bunkrana route, and that should be acknowledged. At the moment it's not, because you know the, the review uh, doesn't lend itself to allowing the second operator, the new operator coming in, um, to have the, the, this dispensation. So I think it's wrong. Uh, I think it's something that we should acknowledge, especially in the Northwest. And if we're, I'm not even going to, Minister, go into the legacy issue in terms of transportation in the Northwest. They're all there to be seen. And the people, be it elderly, people with invalidity passes, people on disability, trying to get from Bunkrana to Derry, they don't have the option of rail. They don't have the option of Irn Road Irn, those lovely, nice carriages um, that you would have from other or inter urban routes. They're not there. The only choice they have is, is this private operator, but an operator, by the way, who's providing an excellent service and obviously because there is no subvention they, are, they can't run a free, a free business either so it's something Minister in your last few hours uh, if I could ask for your indulgence and your direct intervention here to look at a, a way of, of getting around this issue thank you very much Chairman